Excited to be back now with a member of our GMA family, Lindsay Davis, who just wrote her first children's book, The World is Awake. Welcome back. You did a story for us Thank earlier. You. Welcome back. And the thing is, you've been covering all this breaking news here at ABC for over 10 years. And you decided to switch gears and write a children's book. Why? Yes. Well, the answer is sitting right in the front row, and this is unbelievable that Aiden, my son, was actually able to sit here. He's a shy guy. Uh -huh. um, but Aiden and I were in the car one day, and he just said, out of nowhere, he said, um, does God open up the flowers? And I was pleasantly surprised by the question, one, by his curiosity, but also his ability to make the connection. Mm -hmm. and decided if he can do that as a toddler, as a two-year-old, then other kids can. And so why not uh, bring this meaningful and gentle introduction of toddlers to God and just the world around them, kind of married to nature and the little things that excite kids every day. And you said it's important also for children to see themselves in these stories as well. I read an unbelievable essay uh, about uh, windows, uh, windows, mirrors, and sliding glass doors. And the mm -hmm. idea is that it's essential for every children's book to have a mirror so that the child can see themselves reflected in the book, a window so that they can peer out into an unfamiliar world. And when that window is effective, it's able to become a sliding glass door and transport them into this other world. So it's so important for kids to see kids that look like them, kids that don't look like them, and realize mm -hmm. even about our differences, there's a lot more that makes us similar. And I love the title, The World is Awake. To me, it just meant it's alive. And for me, it was a renewed sense because for me, having a child, it reminded me of those little things that used to give us so much joy and excitement, mm -hmm. rainbows and bunny rabbits and butterflies and things that often as adults, I think that we kind of put the blinders on. It's just another day. We're just going through it and seeing my son be so excited and say, oh, look at the butterfly. It's contagious. So now I yeah. say to him, oh, look at the rainbow. Look at this. <laughs> and, and for you, real quick, what was your favorite children's book? So I love uh, Shel Silverstein, Where the Sidewalk Ends. I think that's my all-time favorite. Well, there's no doubt we're going to love this, too. And, and we got to say that the world is awake. It is out right now. And we're going to have more online with Lindsay as well. So make sure you check that out. We'll be right back. I'm going to read to the kids. Yes, we are. Just look at the sunrise that painted the sky. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.